Several viewers have asked how to record YouTube TV shows from a smart TV. And in this short video, I'll show you a few different ways to set up your recordings. First, make sure you have the YouTube TV app installed and signed in on your television. So let's go to the live guide first and record something that's on TV now. Here I can find any show currently airing. I'll just keep scrolling until I find something to watch. So let's record this Beijing tennis tournament. When I select the program, it will take me live to the T2 channel. It's in a commercial break now, but if I hit the down arrow button on my remote, the timeline shows up. Then I'll down arrow again and highlight the plus icon. And here I'll just hit enter on my remote to start recording. The icon will then change to a check mark. I can also record upcoming shows too. So let me find something on another channel. Here on the CBS Sports Network, I can use the right arrow button while still in the live guide to find shows coming on later today. I'll simply select it and then highlight the Add to Library button, and then hit Enter. The plus becomes a check mark and now the show will be recorded later this afternoon at 1.30pm. To find recorded shows in the DVR, I'm going to hit the back button on my remote until I return to the YouTube TV homepage. Then I'll go to the library. Here I can easily find my recorded shows by using the scheduled filter. And I can see the Beijing Tennis Tournament and the CBS Sports program I just set to record. One thing to know is that if the show is a series, it will record every episode of that series. So with CBS Sports HQ Spotlight, the next recording is at 12pm, even though when I set the recording time I chose the 1.30pm airing. So I won't just get one episode, I'll get them all. But it's not a problem because the YouTube TV DVR space is unlimited. You can record as much as you want. Okay, here's one more way to record YouTube TV shows from a smart TV. I can use the search function to find the exact program I want. Here, let's look for Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker. When I select it, I'm taken to the show page. Here, when I choose Add to Library, this movie will be recorded next time it airs. And here's one last thing. If I want to stop recording a program, all I have to do is select the check mark again and it'll turn back to a plus. Right then, that means recording will stop. And what I just showed you is what you need to know to record YouTube TV shows on a smart TV. If this video was helpful, please give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button to stay up to date on all my weekly videos.